Hello YouTube, I'm Volcano, and this is my channel. Welcome. So basically what I've been doing lately is, I've been, you know, throwing up GTA videos of montages or RNGs, deathmatches, whatever. And lately I've decided, like recently I decided, you know what, I want to do this a lot more, you know. I don't really... Nobody really watches, I don't really have any subscribers, but I don't really care about that to be honest. It would be honestly just for my own entertainment and occasionally if somebody, you know, wants to see something, I'll show them. But really, it's just for me because I always found them entertaining. I always found, you know, what I put up or what I do in the game and I, what, I'm, what I'm proud of, I always want to see it, you know, whenever I want to. So that's why I put my first video up. I also like commentary on games, like people playing through games and then just talking while they're playing them. So that be might be something else I might do. But you know, I would need a capture card because I don't really feel like, because otherwise I would have to record and then fucking do what I'm doing now and just it wouldn't be live. It would be you know post play or whatever, which isn't as exciting because it's not spontaneous. Which is what the other other people do. So I would need a capture card, and I don't have one at the moment. So for now, it's just it's just um montages and death matches and shit, and those are fun. Those are cool too. But but you know, once I get a capture card, I have a lot more possibilities. Like you know, if if someone, if anybody were to ever watch this, and anybody would ever say do this you should play this you should talk over this you know I'm totally open I don't care because because to, to me it's all about the commentary it's all about what I say what people say when in these videos it's all about the commentary at least in walkthroughs because for example I'm terrible at Call of Duty I've never played like I played it maybe a few times two or three times I'm really bad at it so if someone said play play some uh, death matches on Call of Duty and talk over them, talk over them live and just react how you react. It would be it would be great because I'm terrible at the game and it would just be funny, I feel like. Not because I'd rage because I don't care, but it would just be like fun to watch and fun just hearing saying me be like, oh fuck man, what the fuck is going on? How the fuck? What, what am I doing? So, you know, that's one example. Another example is just, you know, any other game where there's a campaign mode, a game I've never played, and I don't know anything about it, that would be that would be another because that's another thing people do, just blind walkthroughs where they're just playing the game and have no idea what the hell is going on. And then another type of walkthroughs is a game you know, like the back of your hand. For example, in my case, that would be Resident Evil 4. Because I had it for both the Wii and the GameCube. I had it on the Wii first. I didn't have it on the GameCube originally. I had it on the Wii and I played it to death. And I mean, I played it to death. I would play like on the weekends when I wasn't in school. I would play it. I would play through it, and the next day I would play through the whole thing again. So I would take the whole day and play through that bitch. And when the Wii finally broke, I got it on the GameCube and I did the same shit. I would play through it. The next day I would play through it again. And of course, of course you play on a professional because normal is for bitches, man. But I would play it on professional and my goal was always to see, can I, can I complete the game in zero deaths? And I haven't yet. I came close. I, I beat it in one death. I beat it in one death. And what I would love to do is make a walkthrough with live commentary, beating it in zero deaths on professional. That would be fucking amazing. But um, obviously, like I said, need a capture card and blah, blah, blah. But other than that, I mean, another thing what I could do until I get one is I could do like a tutorial video on, you know, a basic thing like how to shoot, how to, you know, be decent in GTA because I've gotten to the point where I've played this game to death so much that I'm, I'm pretty decent at it. I'm, I like to think I can beat the average player. I'm not top tier, don't get me wrong, but I'm pretty decent at the game. And... So I think, you know, why not? And then when I get better at these RNGs, I can put out a tutorial on how to play RNGs because I was never great at them. 
I'm still not amazing, but I can beat people now. I know I've played them enough so that I can actually win sometimes. So I'd like to, you know, make a tutorial on RNGs because people wonder how the fuck you do them. And 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 I don't I don't believe like there's only one tutorial necessary because everybody has their own tips. Everybody has their own styles of playing. Everybody, you know within the rules of course but everybody has their own tips and advice and you know some people word them better or, you know what some per one person might do another person might not do and vice versa so I don't think you know you should you know there's any problem with it you know it would just be fun to do you know again for my own entertainment <laughs> but yeah about me I've always loved games since as long as I can remember. Like, I used to play Mario and Nintendo, the original one, when I was like four or five. Um, and uh, Mario, basic Mario, along with Pokemon, they both raised me. Pokemon and Mario raised me. Uh, I had I played Pokemon all the time. Um, other games, I liked a lot of games. I was always into racing games. I didn't really get into shooting games until GTA 5. I played GTA 4, I never played online, but once GTA Online, once I got into online on 5, I really started liking. It was really the first shooting game I ever got decent at. Because I was never great at Call of Duty. I was fucking terrible at Halo. Shit like that. But this one I'm decent at. And that's what I'm probably gonna stick with that. I'm not probably gonna try to become a beast at Call of Duty. I'm not. Fuck that. I mean, if it happens, it happens, but I'm, I doubt it because it took me forever to get good at this shit. So, so yeah. But I mean, that's that's really all I've got to say at the at this point. Um, if there's anything else I think of, I guess I'll make another video. This I just I just do. I'm talking over this video because I um, I decided to just do something different. Didn't really feel like putting music over this time. Um, again, it's not textbook. It's an RNG, but I I mean I was kind of like right there. I'm you know kind of whatever camping. I guess you could say, but don't 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 worry. I know how to do them. But this this video was in textbook, so so yeah. But but yeah, the video is about up. So I'm about. I'm about done here. Uh, if anybody has anything to say, message me. You know, comment, whatever. I, I don't care, though. This is if somebody were to see it. I don't expect anybody to, but if. So, yeah. Um, I'm out. Catch you later. Take care.